Hey everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Let's Go. I'm right where we stopped last time where we got Surf from this random guy with his Lapras. And uh, we're in like that little Pokey Park thing. And we're just going to explore this town a little bit. I haven't looked at anything in this town. And uh, we're just going to keep going. There's a gym in this town, I think. I haven't actually looked. Uh, I think we still need the... Po Have I gone to the Poke Center yet? Um, no. I don't need it that bad, but Blastoise is paralyzed, so we probably should help him over there. <laughs> he needs some help. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> Charizard is looking around. Okay. Is there a gym in this town? That's all I care about. I just want to know. Oh, that's a gym. Okay. There is a gym. What type of uh, gym is this? What do we got? Koga. Um, Poisonous Ninja Master. Wow. Well, we're probably going to fight him in this uh, episode, so let me go ahead and grab the Poke Center. I just love how fast Charizard is. Look at this, the guy. He's, he's crazy. Wait. I think I, I went the wrong way twice. How do I actually get to this Poke Center? Is it this way? Then I go around here, and I go up here, and I go this way, and then finally, at the end of this little street, we get to the Poke Center. Okay. It was kind of hidden. Yep. And maybe we'll use Surf for the first time in this episode, too. I don't know. But definitely going to heal up and then uh, see if we can explore the town a little bit and check out the gym. So that's kind of like the main focus for right now. This guy is an EV move master. So, okay, let's see what, what else he has. Yep, I want to see what you got. So Buzzy Buzz, we already know. This one, we already know. Sappy C, we don't know. Freezy Frost, we don't know. Sparkly, I don't think we know that one. Definitely these three, I think we don't know. So let, let me try this one. This is probably a grass move. Let me see what it does. So we got a grass move. Okay. It drains the target's HP every turn. Hmm, that's interesting. So we could get that. But it doesn't, like, heal me. No, it just drains their health every turn. All right. That's that's decent. I want to see what the other one does. What else you got? Uh, Freezy Frost. Here's the ice move. So what does the ice move do? Eevee can learn an ice move. Uh, the user casts... or at, Not casts. The user attacks with a crystal made of cold frozen haze. It eliminates every stat change. I mean... Hmm. That's okay. It removes all stat changes, which I don't think that's super nice. I'd rather have Bouncy Bubble. <laughs> and then let's check out the last one. So, Sparkly Swirl. I don't remember if we've seen this one yet. No, we haven't seen this one. Fairy. The user attacks the target by wrapping it with a whirlwind of, over, of an overpowering scent. What the heck? This also heals all... Oh, that's cool. Of the user's party. Everyone in the party gets healed? That's pretty good. Man, these are actually kind of good. But, Sizzly Slide is my favorite. Batty Bat is good against, you know, certain Pokemon. Bouncy Bubble is just overall a good heal. I could, honestly, Double Edge is kind of a, a troll move for me. Let's try this Sparkly Swirl. I think that's pretty good. I would rather have that than Double Edge. Double Edge to me is kind of just like, <laughs> I don't really need it. Plus, we can always change in and out of these moves. So now my Eevee has all moves from the trainers. Which I feel like is pretty good because, I mean, come on. A Pokemon with four moves of all different types? Can I look at more details? This is crazy. And these are the best moves. These all do 90. The power is 90. That's so good. Yeah, these moves are crazy. So... Now we have more options for Eevee. I'm glad we got that. That's pretty good. Okay. So Eevee learned a new move, which will heal the status conditions of other Pokemon if I use the fairy one. And we got a fairy attack, which could be useful later on. Okay, Safari Zone. Yep, I saw it. I didn't go into it because I don't really want to, but we looked at it, kind of. All right. I don't know if there's any... The rent is really high. <laughs> That's what you have to deal with, living right next to the Poke Center. 
I don't know if there's anything good to do around here. Just to like check out before we head to the gym. Bill's your grandson? Do you know he turned himself into a Pokemon? Should I not tell him that? <laughs> hmm. Oh yeah, Bill developed the boxes and that's pretty cool. Okay. We could try out the Safari Zone. Maybe I should do that quick. Oh! Wait, I didn't even mean to go down here. <laughs> I didn't even mean to go down. I thought I was going the, the way out of here. Um, but Team Rocket's here. Uh, we'd heard there were loads of rare Pokemon in that Go Park place, so we came to check it out for ourselves. But it was so complicated. App this and connectivity that. It was so creepy. We had to get out of there. Who are you talking to? You, yourself? You, are you talking to Meowth? You're talking to Meowth. You're giving Meowth the update. We can't just trip over a get rich quick scheme already. Hmm, it feels like I just kicked something really hard. Like a rock. They're digging for treasure. Gold teeth. No matter how gold they are, some things just aren't worth the effort. I honestly don't know what I am doing here. I just found you guys. Just thrust upon it. A lot of things get thrust upon me in this game. We're busy, so you take care of whatever those are. Okay. Um, anything else in there that I can get? Nothing? He's going to look around? Okay. Yep, you just sniff the air. Uh, oh, that guy almost pulled me into battle. Well, maybe... What is this? Full heal. Are these guys going to want to battle me? Can you guys not battle me? Can I just, like, go... Oh, my... Okay. I don't know if they're going to battle me or not. Probably. The Seafoam Islands. All right, let's check the map here. Because I know for a fact that the legendary Pokemon in this game, the legendary birds, you get one of them... In the Seafoam Islands, you get one at the power plant up here, and then Moltres is at, I think, a volcano. Is there a volcano around here? Where's the volcano? Is it a volcano? I actually know. Maybe it's, maybe it's Cinnabar Island has a volcano. I don't know where that is exactly, but I know where two of them are for sure. Seafoam Islands and the power plant. There's also this route here I haven't gone on. Route 17 and 18. We have not gone there. But. Alright. We know where two are. So. We'll probably head to the Seafoam Islands. If we have time. Uh, later in this. Okay. Let's fly back up here. Well. At least we found out. How to get to the next part of the story. We just have to go that way. Which is pretty easy. So. Let's go to the gym. Because. Oh. Should we do the safari? Okay. Fine. Safari. Let's just try it. I might not do it. But. We gotta at least look. I gotta see what's up. I don't just wanna skip over everyone. Go Park Complex. All you people with your Nintendo Switches. Oh, they're trading. Okay. I had to trade with someone to get my Alakazam. Bring Pokemon, enter a Go Park. Let's. Okay, well. You need to make sure you have 25 Pokemon of the same species. Wait, what? You know what? I think this this is what you do when you want to bring over Pokemon from Pokemon Go. Honestly, I'm not really too worried about that. Oh, this is cool that this, these change. Yeah, so you can bring over Pokemon from Pokemon Go. I'm not too worried about doing that. I thought this was like the Safari Zone, but... Maybe it's not. That's probably different in this game. That's the Pokemon Go complex. Okay, I meant to read the sign, Charizard. Charizard, can you read the sign for me? Read the sign for me. Famous herding game everyone loves. What, Pokemon Go is the herding game? <laughs> Catch as many Pokemon as you can. Okay. Well, what is this here? Safari zone. Oh, this actually... Wait, why is there a... Hello? 
Why are you hiding? No orb? <laughs> what? Let's go in here. Can you actually do this safari zone? Or maybe it's closed? Warden Slowpoke. Can I go talk to him? Or is it under construction? Anyone here can give me an actual explanation? No, he's he gone. He went out fishing. I probably had to find him. Maybe he's at the Seafoam Islands somewhere. Yeah. Well, it's okay. Let's go to the gym then. That was like my main goal of the episode for right now. Look at Growl, dude. So cute. Vulpix, I'm sorry. Vulpix isn't as cute, but... Okay. Yeah, let's do it. So he is fighting. So probably... You know, I could use my uh, Alakazam, right? Alakazam will be good against fighting. And probably Charizard, right? Let me look up. Let me see what's uh, good against fighting. So for fighting, we're going to need... Flying is good, so Charizard is going to be good. And then Sidekick. And Fairy. My new Fairy move for uh, Eevee will be good. So this should be easy. This shouldn't be too difficult. Plus, I'm a little bit overleveled, I think. Wait, why is that guy there? One of the Eevee trainer move guys was there. <gasps> Yo, champ in the making. We have the Safari Zone here in Fuchsia City. We can meet tons of different Pokemon. At the Fuchsia City Gym, we welcome trainers who've met lots of Pokemon. So, I need to see if you've managed to catch at least 50 species of Pokemon. I caught 59. Woo! Good. Okay. I haven't been catching too many Pokemon as of late. Wait. Hello? <gasps> Startled by my disguise? You're a ninja? He can teleport and transform. <laughs> I'm amazed every time I see that. <laughs> okay. He can uh, transform. He can teleport. This guy looks like he's going to be kind of tough. Oh, is there a... It's a maze. It's a maze and... Why is this guy here? These are not the Eevee trainer. He's not going to train me with, with Eevee moves. He's, he's going to want to battle me. Okay. So we're going to go here. We're going to go this ace trainer though. Which, let's fight the ace trainer. We're going to fight the Ace Trainer. He could be worth. I'm just hoping that it's easier to get to the gym leader than it was last time. Last time it was a struggle for me. Okay. We are going to do Psybeam. Just kidding. Muck always uses this. Okay, how about we try it again? There we go. And hurt himself with Moonblast? No? Of course that was a critical. I feel like Alakazam gets beat up so easily. He just gets destroyed. His moves are powerful. We just get smacked around. We need Alexander to level up more. I need my Alexander to be like level 50. Beedrill. Uh. What's good against Beedrill? Maybe fire? Let's do that. Let's use flamethrower. Charizard is going to be pretty good in this gym. Okay. And do this one. Why do they all know Protect? <laughs> is the gym leader also going to have Protect on like all of his Pokemon? Okay, we're, 
we're, we're done. I mean, 700 XP is pretty good for these fights. But I don't need it. You can do just fine without it. I'm already level 50. Okay. Oh, that's not where we have to go. We have to go here and then he he's going to see me. Is there another way? No. Oh. 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 Can I get the thing to show me? <gasps> show me the way. <gasps> There's an ace trainer again. And then... Oh, I can just walk here and... Wait, how close am I to him? <gasps> and... Boom. Right? I can fight him? You want to fight me? You, you want to fight? You want to fight all four of you? A mere child like you dares to challenge me. The very idea makes me shiver with mirth. Very well. I shall show you the true... Show you true terror. As a ninja master. Opponents can't lay a hand on me. As poison brings their steady doom. Despair as you feel the creeping horror of poison type Pokemon. Are you fighting or poison? Are you both? What Pokemon is fighting and poison? Guess we'll find out. Weezing. Hmm. Yeah, Alakazam's probably gonna die in this, so. Keep that in mind. But I'll be able to get some good hits in. Maybe I'll get lucky with the confusion? Please? What? Oh my. <laughs> what the? Wait. <laughs> Wait. Are you kidding me? He used self-destruct basically? And a crit? You crit how do you crit an explosion? How does an explosion critical hit? Is it always critical hit? Man, I didn't want to have to use my other Pokemon already, but wow. Alakazam, I knew he was gonna get destroyed. I knew it was gonna happen. Hopefully I critical against Muck. Please tell me wing attack. Okay, well, guess we'll find out next turn. I like how he's bragging about using all this poison stuff, and then he just uses explosion. That wasn't super effective. You know what's nice? Is I could switch to Eevee and then heal my other Pokemon from the poison. But poison's not doing too much to him right now. Okay, flamethrower. I want to see how much he's going to do. Just kidding. He can use protect every other turn. Because you can't use protect two turns in a row. Ugh. Poison's kind of annoying. I feel like this will do more than a wing attack. Eh. It's doing okay. That does a lot. Poison's doing a ton now. Okay, kill him with this. Now we're gonna switch to Eevee. This is so annoying. It literally does nothing for you. It just wastes, you know, my time. <laughs> it wastes Charizard's, like, attack. <gasps> does Poison do more every, every turn? Okay, kill him right now. Wait, I understand now. He poisons you and then uses Protect so that you get poisoned longer. Okay. You know what? You know what, Koga? You're a little, you're a little smart. You, you know, you definitely got. <gasps> I'm dead. I didn't know I would get hit that last tick. Okay, wow. All right, Koga, you're kind of smart. I will give it to you. You're a little smart. Man, it wouldn't have mattered though. He had like no health, so. Who is gonna be? This is gonna be good against you. Maybe? Please? No. It's not very effective, but I still crit. Oh, <laughs> I have to use an attack, right? Yeah, 
Ooh, I dodged the fly. Let's use my... Is dark moves good against him? Oh, well, not even poisoned yet. Yeah, I didn't think Charizard would die that quickly, but... I guess poison can actually do a lot. He's going for the fly again. Let's use this to maybe heal off the fly. Oh, well, he's going to attack first. Okay, fine. Do it. do it, Golbat. Yeah. Was that worth it? He's going to protect again. Yeah. Every other turn, have to protect, even though you never even poisoned me. Then we're going to use my uh, fire attack. I will give it to this guy. He is the most annoying gym leader so far. I will say that. What else do you got? Venomoth. Okay. I feel like Sizzly Slide. Well, he's gonna. Is he gonna protect? Let's just use this. No, he didn't use it. Yeah, that's super effective. Cause he's. He's bug, right? All right, we're good. At least the last uh, Pokemon he had was easy. Here, take a soul badge. Give me that high five, Eevee. Now that you have a soul badge Pokemon up to level 70, we'll heed your command if you receive them in a trade. Take this too. Toxic. Okay, we got it. Yep, 4,000 4, years of uh, being toxic. And he gives it to me. Or not, four, was it 400? Did I say 4,000? 4, 400. Okay, fine. Not that many years. Not 4,000. Yeah, Evie's really pumped about that. Evie is happy about destroying Kogo. Because... Well, my other Pokemon died. There you go, Eevee. All right. What, you want more? Hello? <gasps> Wait, what do you have? A leaf? What's in the leaf? A leaf letter. A letter written on a leaf. Something is written using Eevee's footprints. Eevee can write using his footprints? I feel like Eevee's, like, smarter than me. <laughs> is Eevee smarter than me? He can communicate by writing. What happens if I look at that thing? Let's see. It's got to be in here. <gasps> Leaf letter. Well, I can't use it yet, but maybe I'll use it later. All right. Let's go to the Poke Center. Too many Pokemon died, but Eevee survived. <laughs> Eevee was able to do it. But hey, I learned something about the uh, poison. I didn't know that it gets stronger. Because I'm pretty sure it was getting stronger and doing way more. But yeah, Koga had a decent strategy in mind. And it actually kind of worked. But now I think either we try to go to the Seafoam Islands or we go to the left of the town over here and see where this goes. This is also a way to Route 18. Oh, but this just goes back to Celadon City. So this is a way. But it's a pretty long way. I'm not going to check the map again. And there's a trainer blocking this. Oh. I just want to look. I want to see what we're up against if we're going to go this way. I don't really need to. Unless there's something like... Maybe there's some good Pokemon on this route. Wait. Wait, what? Why am I... Why can I fly so high? Oh my. Wait, Charizard can fly? Why can I fly this high? I'm confused. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just like so amazed. Why can I fly this high? This is amazing. I can just fly over everything. I feel like super powerful. Okay, what happens if I want to go down? 
Charizard likes it. What, can I read the sign? No? Okay, I want to read the sign, but... <laughs> We're just going to fly over everyone. Route 17, can I land? How do I land? Is it possible to land? <laughs> um... These trainers have their Pokemon, like, out next to them, too. Man, this is amazing. I can just not even care about anything. There's a coach trainer. Don't care. There's a lot of other trainers. Oh, Ponyta. Can you land? How do I land? Do I have to actually, like, remove you? Okay. Machamp can also carry you. What happens? Do I just fall? Look at this! Machamp can also carry you on his back. Which is cool. Okay, we got Ponita. Uh, 37 though. That's pretty good. Can you jump back? Can you jump to the right again? Please? Can you jump to the right? I'm pretty bad at moving. Um, okay, well, that was a waste. Yep, that was the thing. How do I throw it to the left? I always forget. It doesn't throw to the left. Well, it kind of did. Actually, it didn't at all. Are you serious? <laughs> Wait, why was that so easy? I totally missed. I only got 200. That wasn't worth, but... Got Ponita, I mean... Cool. Kind of. Guess we'll grab this. Well, this is an interesting route. So maybe since the wind is like blowing like that, that means I can fly with Charizard. There's like flowers. He's gonna wanna challenge me. Oh, we got a, what is that? Ah, I forgot his name. It's like Dodrio or it's like do duo and then it becomes like do trio something like that oh. okay yep you can jump but it's not gonna matter easy ultra balls are pretty crazy good thing about like 60 yeah we're gonna catch a little bit of pokemon out here because it's been a while since I've actually like gone on a route and caught the Pokemon there. So we'll just do this for a little bit. If I see any Pokemon we don't have, I'll go for them. If I see a Rattata, I'm not going to care. What? Oh, all these people have uh, Eevee. Wait, does that mean Eevee's in here? There definitely could be an Eevee spawn somewhere. Do you turn or can I... Can you turn so I can, you know, run past? <laughs> can I go? Oh, I thought I could go through there. I might have to battle this person. Hmm. Yeah, probably. Uh, do Eevee spawn in this route? Maybe in these? Oh, that person didn't fight me. That's good. This seems like a pretty good spot for... I don't know. If all these people have Eevee evolutions then I feel like there's a good chance. You know what? We should pop a max lure or maybe just a super lure. Where do Eevee spawn? Is this route 18? What was the route that... This is 17. 18's... We just passed 18, I think. This is 18. Hmm. Okay. What you want to do is go ahead and pop a super lure just because I want to see what kind of Pokemon we can get spawning out here. I have nine of them, so why not? Let's do it. I don't want to go up there. But for now, let's just see if the super lure can get anything to spawn in the grass here. Let's see what we can get. Because this is a lot of grass. Okay, Ponita. Eevee. Evie got excited. I don't know what Evie saw. Oh my. Should we get a catch combo going for Ponita? <gasps> yep, we're doing that. We're going to get a catch combo. Ponitas. Could work out. Could work. No, don't. A nice? I feel like that's pretty bad. Like <laughs> Getting a nice is not good, but if it wants to... Yeah, doesn't really matter. 
We're good. Okay. We're gonna try to get a catch combo, and then maybe Eevee will spawn, because I feel like Eevee could spawn here. If Eevee doesn't spawn here... Oh my gosh, why is there so many Ponita? I mean, it just seems likely, though, because, you know... Why else would they all have Eevee... Evolutions? <laughs> Dang it. That was really close. There's no way you escape. There's no way you escape this. I refuse to believe it. What? How? What else am I supposed to do? Like, what more could I do than that? Oh, can you please jump back to the left? Oh, that is not even remotely close. Um, I don't think I can throw it that far. I'm going to be honest. Nope, I, I need you to jump to the left. Well, you're right. Thank you. <laughs> My left, you're right, Ponita. <laughs> Okay, well, that's fine. Not crazy XP. There's more there, but... Oh, man. So many. Wait, is that Eevee? <gasps> oh, my... I knew Eevee spawned here. I didn't even realize that was Eevee. Eevee's so small. <gasps> it's so cute! Oh my, level 39. Okay. <gasps> no, okay. Here we go. We're gonna we're gonna use some stuff here. We're gonna do some stuff. We are gonna use this. And then we're gonna go for this. And then we're gonna go for this! Oh, great. Eevee might actually be kinda hard to catch. Okay, Eevee, come on. Please. Please. Don't act tough on me. Don't act tough, because that's an excellent. Don't act tough, Eevee. I'm going to catch you. Yes. Okay. I'm excited. All right. This is good. I don't care if we lost the catch combo. It was only two. All I cared about getting was Eevee, because we need some extra Eevees in order to get the other evolutions. <laughs> Let me try to look for more. Oh, my God. <gasps> Dude, he runs so fast. <laughs> Did you see how fast it was running? What the heck? It was running so fast. It was like an actual horse, like running at top speed. Oh, we need a. Uh... Oh, I can keep trying to catch it like this. We don't need a berry. I feel like I can do it. <laughs> Give me. Ooh, that was good. That was pretty good. If you want to be caught, I didn't see what level you were. Yes! We need one more. I'm pretty sure there's three different evolutions you can get for Eevee. We're going to look for one more. If that Rapidash charges me, I mean, I'll try to catch it. Where are you? Oh my. There's another one. Why is it so fast? That's like the fastest Pokemon I've ever seen. It's huge. Well, it's tiny, but it's huge. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you want some of this? You want some of this? Can you ride this Pokemon? It's a horse. I mean, why can't... There's got to be a way to ride this Pokemon. Wait. That wasn't excellent? How many Ultra Balls do I have? Okay, good. We got it. I mean, it's it's a horse. It's, it's big, but it was also you know tiny at the same time because that's what it told me. And I believe it, kind of. Can I actually ride a Rapidash? Let's see. Yeah, it loves running. This has got to be a Pokemon you can ride. Okay. We're looking for one more Eevee. Super Lure out here is the way to go. So many Pokemon spawn. Like, look at the variety here. Just so... M oh, that's the... Okay. We should go for that. I just want to try to catch it. Do trio is that how you say it? I don't know. Or not do trio. Do do trio. I like kind of knew the name. I just knew it was something like three because there's three of them. All right, we're gonna try to get it right here. 
Do Duo, Do Trio, something like that. Well, these guys might be difficult to catch here. I'm gonna try. Man, really? What else do you expect me to do? Oh, I hate when they jump that far. Can you jump back over? Okay, I try to like throw it over there, but it doesn't work. Okay, I, I'm barely getting that. Oh, never mind. Never, never mind. One more. Excellence are not working against these guys. How many Ultra Balls do I have? 35. Well, I'm not really upset if I don't catch these guys. I don't really care too much. Is it really worth... I don't like how much they jump. Oh my, I'm running. I'm not catching that Pokemon. <laughs> that is too much. I'm not using a berry. <gasps> There's so many Pokemon. Okay. I only care about Eevee. And yeah, that's about it. Uh, no, don't need that. Okay, yep. You're really fast too. A lot of fast moving Pokemon. I'm not going for you. I don't care that much. I wonder if it's kind of rare that I got two Eevee to spawn. <gasps> oh, I almost got pulled. I almost ran straight into him. Yeah, I wonder how rare it is that Eevee spawn out here. Because I got two of them. I could always come back later and try to get the third. It's going right for me. Oh, should we use another... I don't know. I feel like we did pretty good. Let's go and bag. I want to grab Rapidash and just try. Because I feel like... Look at how many Raticate I've caught. Um, I want to just move Pokemon. Well, add to party quick. Just switch it out with Machamp. And see... If I can ride it. Because it makes sense, right? That I can ride it. How fast is it? Oh, it's pretty fast. <laughs> oh, it's pretty fast. I don't want to battle you. I, I could have ran so far past you that you wouldn't have been able to catch up to me on my horse. No way. And he's an ace trainer. All right. We are going to wrap up soon after this. I just wanted to test out to see if I could use the rapid ash. I mean, it's pretty cool. I had to try. Okay, what are you gonna do? You're gonna hurt yourself? No. Nope. Oh, this is Surf. It's pretty intense. I know we said that I was gonna try and use Surf in this episode, and we didn't, but that's because I decided to go this way. But we definitely will next time because we need to go to the Seafoam Island, so we'll use Surf next time. Yeah, he's, uh... I mean, my Alakazam is okay. What does Nightshade do? I kind of forgot. Decent. He got to 42. Probably going to switch out for a different Pokemon. But at least you got to see some uh, new routes in this one. We actually went and tried to catch the Pokemon here. Isn't Psybeam good against... Well, I'm going to die, though. Hmm. I think Charizard is pretty good. I'm just going to try it. But yeah, we got some good Pokemon caught here. I just think the route is super cool looking. Swing attack good? Is this super effective? No, it's it's not very effective at all. This is super effective against him though. Okay, well. Man. This is not gonna be that good. He's gonna die. Who's good against Definitely not Blastoise. I guess we'll send out Eevee. Let's go with this. Thunderbolt's still powerful even when it's not like super effective. Okay. What about dark moves? It's 
Bam, Thunderbolt. I'm just gonna use my fire move next. This like random trainer that I just happened to run into is actually pretty good. Oh, that's super effective. Wait, fire is super effective? Oh, I could use flamethrower. Okay, well. Learn that for next time we fight one of those guys. Marowak. Marowak is fighting, right? Is Fairy good against? No, I don't think it is. I'm gonna heal. Oh, that's super effective too. It must be like rock. Yeah, he's rock. Okay, there we go. Let's finish that off. But yeah, I had fun this episode. Beat the gym leader. This was a super cool route. I think this is like my favorite route. Plus it has Eevee. And I could evolve one of the Eevees. Five Ultra Balls. I'll take them. Let's see quick. Do I have a... Can I evolve an, an Eevee from... I got a Firestone and an Ice Stone. No, they have to be in your party. Let's go ahead and evolve one of them. Where's the other EVs that we just caught? There they are. Both level 39. That's pretty good. I'm going to switch it out for Blastoise right now. And then I'm going to switch this one out. Or Actually, hold, hold up. I want to move that EV. I'm going to move this one to party, switch out for Venusaur, and then we're going to evolve both, I think. But I think Ice Stone doesn't work, right? No, I need Water Stone or something like that. Yeah, I think I need like a Water Stone, but I can use Fire Stone. We can do this. Get Flareon. There we go. I'm going to have to buy the other stones. We're like Thunderstone and Water Stone. But I need one more Eevee if I'm going to evolve all of them. I'll take the Flareon. Oh, Flareon looks so cute. There we go. I always wanted a Flareon. Nice. Okay, I'm happy with that. Ember. I'll probably teach him... If I actually use him, I'll teach him Flamethrower. Helping hand, just remove that. It's whatever. I might look for another EV in between episodes. It just depends how much time I have and if I feel like doing it. Because I love the EV evolutions. They look so awesome. But, and then maybe I'll get the other uh, stone that we can use to evolve the other one. But yeah, you can't actually run with Rapidash, which I thought it makes sense, right? And uh, yeah, kind of cool. So, I'm actually going to end it. <gasps> okay, that was so close. We're running. But yeah, I'm going to end the uh, episode. Look how, look at how, this the stride. This is one step. That's one step on Rapidash. You just move so much. But yeah, I'm going to end the episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like on it. Definitely subscribe. So you don't want to post the next one. Other than that, that's going to do it for me. So thanks again for watching. I'll see you all next time.